I ran out of drinking water for coffee and tea, so I need to filter some more. I don't have a countertop at the moment, but I'm going to hook up the water filter anyway. Put on the shutoff valves, make sure that they don't leak. Before I connect the filter, I'm going to run some water through the lines just to make sure there's no construction debris left in there. The next issue is this water filter uses a 3 8 line, and the only adapter I have is a splitter, so I guess I have to hook up the kitchen faucet too. And as you might have noticed, I did install a countertop, a piece of scrap drywall that I had in the other room. If it's good enough for the coffee maker, it should be good enough for this water filter, at least for a day or two. A piece of plywood would last longer, but I don't need it to last long. Make sure I have the faucet in the off position, and then slowly turn on the water. Always slowly turn on the water, just in case you have a leak, you don't have a big leak. Had to run back up to the camper to get this rubber washer that fell out and I missed. That's looking a lot better. I can also see I need a receptacle under the sink. For now, I'll just plug it in above the countertop. And the drain line, well, it's going down the drain. 